You and Schizo, you find them? The explosives? Yeah, Mike, uh, we got them. Schizo's on his way back with everything that we found. Listen, Mike, I gotta tell you. That's great. That's great! Now, we can't use them till we find some dead cord. You know that, right? I'll take a look through the files we got. Mike, listen to me. Schizo, he's a... Jesus, what now? You boys trying to shoot your damn heads off again? No, Mike, but he, uh... He must have run the camp, Mike. He told me him... Oh, hell, I know all about that. Remember, I told you already. Schizo thinks I'm a pacifist and I'm gonna get us all killed. I know he's been talking. Mike! Deke, like I said, Schizo's got his issues, but it... <sighs> it it's not like we don't got ours. Thanks for your concern. <laughs> Okay. Deke, like I said, Schizo's got his issues, but it... <sighs> it's not like we don't got ours. Thanks for your concern, but I can take care of myself. Mike out. Uh, Jesus, right. your way, Iron Mike. You always do. Can use this. Gotcha. Boozer. Oh. Boozer, you there? Yeah, dude. I just got off work. I got to spend the morning hauling buckets of shit. Oh, Jesus, goddamn schism. I'd be lying if I told you I'd be I'm gonna count to three, what and you, you better drop your gun and show yourself. One, two, three. into it. It takes time. Just don't get your hopes up, brother. That's all I'm saying. Out. Finally. Yeah, I'll bet you got a job for me. Uh, okay, I'll stop by. You can up.
This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Today, I want to talk about drugs. Now, I don't much care for them. They keep you numb, unreliable, and silent. In 1996, the CIA was accused of dealing cocaine in Central America. Used it to help them control the masses. Get the Fed's sticky fingers on a slice of the global pie. And once they figured out how well that shit worked, well, they decided to set their sights here at home. Make drug addicts of us good old American taxpayers. They brought cocaine up from South America by the plane load. Barrels of the stuff got us hooked on it. Kept us complacent. Kept us high. Kept us under the heel of their rich boots. And oh, did they get... Oh, I think that's it. Misery. Roads will be yeah, a little safer now. Operations. I mean, not all much, all destroying the very heart and little. soul of this good country. But thankfully, at last, all that is in the past. At least, for my people. Stay sober, people. Stay alive. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Yeah, you ever lose an arm, Cope? Maybe when you do, you'll find yourself wanting a bottle of whiskey, or two, or three. In the meantime, shut the hell up. Bunker, yeah, I bet they had a bunker. Just gotta find it. Take this. now. Hey, this is handy. A map. All marked up. Yeah, and I... I guess they won't be needing it. <laughs> Not anymore.
Another narrow injector. Good. Hmm. Oh, always had trouble concentrating. Micro recorders. Oh, oh man, happened the check in yesterday was a nightmare. Yeah? What happened? <laughs> man, they thought there was a leak in my suit. Kept me in decon for two hours. Oh, well, at least they cleared you. Yeah. yeah. Thank God. What was it? I don't know. A glitch on the onboard or something. Jesus. <laughs> you imagine being terminated for a glitch in your onboard? Uh, no. But thanks for bringing it up. No problem. Glitch in the onboard. So what? Did the top brass blow you out of the sky to keep you from coming back and contaminating everyone? Oh, God. Done. Where's Boozer? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I thought he was with you. Yeah, he was, and then he, he took off. Some shit. Excuse me, what the fuck are you telling me? Get off me! Look, he grabbed a bottle of whiskey, he said he was going home. I don't know. Motherfucker, and you didn't even try to stop him, did you? Hey! We tried! <laughs> you gotta know when to cut a man loose. You gotta know when a man's done. Ricky, you there? What's wrong? Boozer went out, but he didn't come back. Shit. You heading up there? Uh, need help? No, I'll find him. Boozer, you there? Boozman! Uh, yeah, Deke. Yeah, Deke. No, I'm here. Where the hell are you? It's, it's getting dark out. Where? Jesus, stay there. I'm coming to get you. Just, just stay here. I got it. I got it. He's <laughs> okay. I'm at the, uh, the farm. Oh, McDonald's uh, farm. Crap. I'm gonna need my bike. Alright, here's the farm. This is where Ricky said the work crew was. Boozer! You there? Boozman! Damn it! Okay, here's the farm. Hey, where's Boozer? Who? Nah, no, there's no one here. Work crew's gone home for the day. No, he's still here. The, the big guy with one arm. Yeah, yeah, I know who you mean. He headed off that way. Towards the old farmhouse. Thought he was getting a ride there. 
If you see him, tell him, tell him to stay here. Radio me or Ricky. Sure, man. Whatever. said that he had a, a bottle of whiskey. Where would he go to drink a bottle of whiskey? One of these uh, farmhouses? This. Boozer! Are you in here? Nope. Not in here. These. These are his boot prints. They gotta be. This looks like it. Good book to read. Whiskey bottle. Empty. Wait a second. Case of beer? Let's take a look around. What do we got? Let's see, what's going on here? Gotcha. Beer bottle, empty. Heading that way. Damn it. Excuse those right. He's heading home. He's on foot. He can't have gotten far. I'm gonna need my bike. Boozer! Booze man! Hey, Dick. <laughs> How's it going, brother? You said you were at the farm. I just left, and you are not at the farm, Boozer. Uh... We... Oh! Oh! The other farm. Dick, I'm, um... I, I, I went to the other farm, you know, I, I found a sixer, <laughs> so I thought I'd go for a walk, you know, like a slow walk at sunset, so uh, I just walked to the other farm, you know. Oh, McDonald had a yeah, yeah, ah, shit. Jesus, Boozer, what are you doing?
Boozer, are you in here? Booze man. Upstairs. Nowhere. Boozer. Booze. See, I, I thought you were gonna come um, have a beer with me and take a walk. Boozer, just where are you? Would you look around? Did you tell me what you see? What's nearby? Give me a give me a landmark or something. I already told you. Oh, oh, look at that shit. Look at what, Boozer? What do you see? The road. The roads. Uh, wow, it's just it's gone. Like, like somebody came and just like, whoosh, swept it away. The road's gone? Oh, yeah. The, the, like, somebody came and just swept it away. Gone. I'm walking. And walking. I'm, and, and now the road is just gone. Where, where are you going, Boozer? That's where I'm going. Oh. Just stay right there. Just stay where you are. Get down. Get out of sight. Listen for my bike. I'm coming. I'm not hiding from no one. I'm going home. Dude. Home. Hey, sir. Gotta be him. Which way? There you are. What do we got? Back on track. Boot prints. Bingo. Give him a ride without my bike. Boozer, you there? I'm getting close. I, uh, I followed your tracks. Just like you taught me. Uh, Boozer, come on, man. Stay put, will ya? for a stroll. Hey, Dig. How's it going, old buddy? Boozer, where are you going? Oh, that's where I'm going, home. Oh, well, we can't go back to O'Leary Mountain. No, I'm not going to fucking O'Leary Mountain. I'm going to farewell. Shit, come on. We gotta no, get you. No, no, no. You wanna take a swing at me? Fine. Get in line behind them. Bring it! Okay. So this is it? This is how we're going out? out no, here, no, I don't think so. Huh, Boozer? Huh? Bro? Boozer? The nice year old lady was killed. What did I say to you? I did not tell What did I say to you, huh? I found you halfway through a case of whiskey. You were gonna drink yourself to death. What did I say to you? You grabbed a bottle. And you chugged it. It was a lot of goddamn whiskey. And you told me that if I was gonna drink myself to death, you'd be right there with me. That's what brothers do. So like I said, Boozer... Is this it? This is how we're going out. Let's get down 
hell out of here. Go, go, go! I'm going! Go faster then. Cars! Wrecked cars. I see him, loser! Of them. Uh, we're gonna be okay. I, I knew. I knew it all along. Hey, hey, Deke. Boozer, listen. I just want to say thank you. I mean it. Boozer, uh, just listen, goddammit. You came out here and you saved my sorry ass. Again. I owe you, brother. I owe you. No, no, Boozer. I owe you. All right, look. Someone's at the gate. If it weren't for you, I uh, I would have been dead a long time ago, or worse. You're gonna be okay. Oh hell yeah. Oh, I hear a bunk calling my name. <laughs>